Howdy folks, Laxo here. And today we're going to be talking about something that I've actually been wanting to talk about for a, a couple weeks here. Unfortunately, or fortunately, um, Worlds did come out. By the way, if you guys are curious, if you want to see when the next Worlds is, you can see it's right here in about 1,000 hours. So when people say, it came early, it came early, and no, it didn't come early, it's scheduled after every Worlds, the timer resets, so... A uh, thousand hours, we're going to go ahead and get another Worlds. However, the topic I want to talk about, that have actually that has actually been going around for a couple weeks now. And the Brazilian community, by the way, shout out to the Brazilian community. Thank you very much. You guys showed me a lot of support and love in the last video I made. So thank you guys. Thank you thank you to the Brazilian community. You guys are awesome. Uh, I appreciate you. And uh, speaking of which, if you guys have already subscribed, that subscribe button down there. I'd appreciate it. And uh, as I was saying... Zero recharge. That's what I was going to talk about. I believe the person who brought it to fruition is a YouTuber. I believe he goes by the YouTube uh, Gorehouse Gamer. Uh, super cool guy. Great guy. Um, he's actually a pretty strong player as well in in, in Bleach. So, um, yeah, shout out, shout out to him. Great YouTuber. If you guys haven't already checked him out again, Gorehouse Gamer, go check him out. And I think Mass, Mass X actually covered it as well in uh in a video a couple weeks ago uh zero recharge what it pretty much is saying and let's just do the tldr on this is pretty much telling oasis you know we're tired of you giving us zero content nothing nothing to look forward to nothing to have fun with i mean besides you know kempachi contests which is the regularly scheduled thing uh worlds which is again a regularly scheduled thing and Let's see what else we get. We get uh, uh, special event units, which is once every month, once every two months. So we do get a little bit of content, but however, us players in the actual top, I want to say uh, two, three, four hundred servers, something like that. We've had zero content for the last, what, three or four months now. We've had nothing to look forward to, nothing to do. We've had soul box after soul box after soul box. And it's getting kind of repetitive and boring and annoying. So uh, this is pretty much just, you know, telling them, give us something. And the first time I heard that again a couple weeks ago, my thought was, but if we don't give them money, they won't be able to come out with anything. And then I actually thought about it and I said, wait, what the, what the heck are you saying, dude? We've been giving them money for months now. And by the way, I, when I say give them money, I mean, you know, purchase things, recharges um, for months now, months and months. And they've given us nothing except for soy phone. Like, come on, guys, you know, show us something, show us love. And a lot of the things that they did in the actual soy phone event was just recycled from the last event. I didn't really want to harp on that too much or talk about it too much. Because I was trying to have a positive attitude, but it, it it did you know, it did upset me a little bit in in in, in the back of my mind. So um, I kind of just laughed and was like, "Well, you know, it is what it is. Moving on." So yeah, that's pretty much what we're going. Oh, we also get the season pass too. And uh, speaking of season pass, they actually refresh the season pass immediately. I was actually. Um, slightly, like, almost offended by that. As soon as the season pass ended, they threw out another one at you. And it's like, wait, 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 wait. Really, guys? So I messaged support, and I and I was pretty up forward with them. And I said, yo, why the heck are you giving us another season pass immediately after another one? Why aren't you giving us a new character? And their response was actually adequate in... Um, in what I was expecting, you know, uh, if you guys didn't uh, already know, probably a couple a couple months ago, I went ahead and did a suggestion video for Oasis. It was like a 40 minute long video. I went over all the analytics of them actually viewing the video. I did it live on YouTube. I pulled up my analytics. I went through all the numbers, the time that they spent watching it, where they watched it. You know, I went over all those things in my videos. So uh, go back and check out that one again. Uh, July. It was probably mid-July is when I did it. And, uh... 
one of the things I requested in, in the video, or I'm sorry, I should uh, clarify, the community requested in that video, because it was a community effort, um, was give us these characters, give us season pass characters, because a lot of people, what they did is they missed a couple days, couple months, this and that, and they missed a bunch of these characters, so give us a chance to get these characters instead of, you know, once ever, if you miss them, you miss them. So, in response to that, they went ahead immediately, probably uh, a few weeks after that, they put out this season pass. And they gave us these. And that again, that was in direct response to, uh, to my request. So, shout out to Oasis for doing that for us. And... Uh, yeah, they went ahead and give us another one immediately after, and that was pretty much, you know, as I said, I was pretty much perturbed by that. And I messaged them, and they said, you know, we're trying to help out all the people that immediately, um, or I'm sorry, that missed the characters. We're trying to really just put it out there for everybody to, um, to get the characters. You know, I mean, you guys can't really complain with free resources just for logging in, so. I'm actually cool with it. I'm totally cool with that. And I'm I'm happy with the response. So um as you guys can see I haven't I haven't touched this. I don't plan on doing this at all. Unless unless of course we get a new character in October. And speaking of October, that brings me to the last topic I want to cover with this video, and that is I was talking to somebody from Oasis, not gonna give out any names or anything like that, but uh they pretty much clarified that you know they told me, hey, you know. Uh, Lax, we're working on uh, we're working on mul multiple new units of right now, um, so that was pretty much what I have, what we as the community have been looking forward for, or two for a while. You know, more content specifically, but more units because we haven't gotten a new unit in months. And uh, well, since uh, it is October. And I do believe in a week we're going to get the uh, um, Thousand Year Blood War arc. Hey, maybe they're going to go, maybe they're going to go directly into the Thousand Year Blood War arc. You never know. We can always hope. We can always pray that that is the case. But uh, I think what they should do is maybe make those Thousand Year Blood War arc characters event characters. Why? The newer, the newer servers, you know, 800 plus, they don't have to wait two and a half years, three years to get the characters. So, I feel like that would probably be ideal, but it is what it is. But anyways, guys, I think that is actually just about going to wrap this video up here. If you guys enjoyed this content, once again, hit that subscribe button down there, right there at the bottom. Should be right around here somewhere. Um... And if you guys want to participate in the Zero Recharge, hey amen. All the power to us, and uh, I hope it actually gets through and works. But nonetheless, I'm excited to see what the game has coming out and what the uh, Thousand Year Blood Arc has to bring us as well. But as I said, guys, let's wrap this one up. Hope you enjoyed. Catch you on the next one.